you're welcome to solve this nice exponential equation, which is 9 to power x, this is equal to 54. What is the value of x? Now let's prevent the solution from here. We have 9 to power x, this is equal to 54. To solve for x here, we introduce logarithm on both sides. So here we have log 9 to power x, this is equal to log 54. You find that rock 9 to power x, this is in the form of rock a to power n, which we can express as n rock a. Applying this power root property of logarithm, then it follows that rock 9 to power x can be expressed as x rock 9. This is equal to rock 54. Let's divide both signs by rock 9 here. Yeah. And also here by rock 9. Let's simplify here. Rock 9 and rock 9 simplifies so that x is equal to rock 54 divided by rock 9. We can express 54 basically as 9 times 6. Substituting this, we'll have x is equal to rog 9 times 6 divided by rog 9. We have that rog 9 times 6, this is in the form of rog a times b, which we can express as rog a plus rog b. Now, applying this logarithm property, then we have that x is equal to rog 9 over rog 9, then plus rog 6 divided by rog 9. So let's simplify here, rog 9 and rog 9 simplifies, so that x is equal to 1 plus rog 6 over rog 9. We have that x is equal to 1 plus rog 6 over rog 9. We can express 6 as 2 times 3. So this implies that x is equal to 1 plus rog 2 times 3 over rog 9. Now applying the logarithm property that's rog a times b, this can be expressed as rog a plus rog b. Applying this logarithm property, then we have that x is equal to 1 plus, this is rog 2 over rog 9, then plus rog 3 over rog 9. The next step is that we can express 9 as 3 to power 2. Therefore, this implies that x is equal to 1 plus, this is rog 2 over rog 9, which is rog 3 to power 2, then plus rog 3 divided by rog 3 to power 2. The next step is that rog 3 to power 2, this is in the form of rog a to power n, which can be expressed as n rog a. Applying this property, then we have that x is equal to 1 plus, this is rog 2, divided by rog 3 to power 2, which is 2 rog 3, then plus rog 3, divided by rog 3 to power 2, which is 2 rog 3. And in this case, let's simplify here rock 3 and rock 3 simplifies so that x is equal to 1 plus a half rock 2 over rock 3 then plus a half so we have 1 plus a half so this implies that x is equal to 3 over 2 then plus a half this is rock 2 over rock 3 so this implies that rock 2 over rock 3, this is in the form of rock a over 
rock B, which can be expressed as rock A to base B. Applying this property, applying this logarithm property, then this implies that x is equal to half into the parentheses, we have 3 plus log 2 to base 3. Now this is the value of x. Let's verify that this value of x satisfies the equation by following these steps. Now let's verify that this value of x satisfies the equation. If you recall here, we have that 9 to power x, this is equal to 54. Let's substitute the value of x from here. So we have 9 to power half. Into the parentheses, we have 3 plus log 2 to base 3. This is supposed to give us a value of 54. Now, we can express 9 as 3 to power 2. Substituting this, this implies here we have 3 to power 2 times half into the parentheses 3 plus rock 2 to base 3. This is equal to 54. The next step is that let's simplify here so that we have 3 to power 3 plus rock 2 to base 3 this is supposed to give us a value of 54 now we have that 3 to power 3 plus rock 2 to base 3 this is in the form of a to power n plus m which we can express as a to power n times a to power m applying this exponent property then this is the same thing as 3 to power 3 times 3 to power rog, 2 to power 3, this should give us a value of 54. Now, 3 to power 3 from here, this is the same thing as 3 times 3 times 3. This is the same thing as 27. So this implies that here we have 27 times 3 to power rog, 2 to base 3. They should give us a value of 54. So you find that 3 to power of 2 to base 3, this is in the form of m to power of a to base m, this is equal to a. So this implies that 3 to power of 2 to base 3, they should give us a value of 2. And therefore, here we have 27 times 2, they should give us a value of 54. So 27 times 2, this is 54, which is equal to 54. So this implies that the left add side is equal to the right add side. And this implies that the value of x, which is equal to a half into the parentheses 3 plus rock 2 to base 3, satisfies the equation. So can you follow the steps? Like this video and subscribe. See you in the next video.